Hello, everybody. Hey, friends. Welcome to Angie's Kitchen. <laughs> we decided that we were gonna just, you know, it's the last week of the year for us, and yes. we're just gonna, you know, spice things up, do things a little bit differently. Um, yes, because even with being end of the season, end of, you know, this year, and end of sometimes a season in life. Definitely. A season in life where things are different, and it's not always easy. No. It's not it's always not. easy. It's not easy. Um, we've been talking about, you know, Christmas and traditions. And I think we're starting a new tradition. So we're going to start making cookies together. <laughs> because when you have halfway almost grown people in your house. Mine are all grown. And they're gone because they're working. Yep. Um, those traditions of making cookies together, it just doesn't but, exist anymore. No, it doesn't. It's not easy to no. continue them. Yes. And uh, we're working through all of that. And I know yes. that there's a lot of y'all that are working through that this year. Yes. You know, the, the Christmas holidays have got to, you know, just the times together have got to be planned more. Yes. And I suck in planning. <laughs> Sorry, I am really not good at it. And, and sometimes even like a month out wasn't enough for us to plan no. for things. There's just no. too, there's too many moving parts. Exactly, and variables, and, and, and with children's different schedules and other people's in their lives, it's just really, really hard. Like we're not even having our Christmas until the day after Christmas. Christmas. Yeah. And I don't know. It was the first day that all of us could be together at the same time. time. Yeah. And so if you've been through this season, yes, let's start. If you've been through this season, maybe you can drop a couple hints of advice. I would love uh, it. If you guys, like, what do you do with your grown children? children. Like, what yes. does your Christmas look like with your grown, grown children? children? Yes. One of the, um, one of my friends on Facebook, their family, um, she said likes, um, oh, one of the Christmas movies anyway. And they had, um, pajamas on that were like themed from that movie. Mm -hmm. And they get together and she makes cookies, the cutout cookies, sugar cookies, yeah. the day before. And then they all get together and they decorate the cookies and they eat food and they exchange gifts and mm -hmm. and whatnot. But they, it's not, it wasn't on Christmas. It was, I think it was last, last weekend. Exactly. That they got together. And I, I have a friend too. They, they just visiting different houses at different times. So they, it's smaller and more intimate because getting everybody together is just really really hard yeah it's it's it's, it's been a challenge it's it's a challenge and um uh, so if you've been through this season you know let us know how you're doing it and if you're not there yet oh my goodness enjoy mamas mamas enjoy the craziness enjoy the craziness and whatever the kids want to do or not do just do it say yes say yes say yes but i also at, at the same yeah. time don't you don't have to say yes to everybody exactly because the too much business busyness and then you don't enjoy the moments yes and this year i'm to the point where i have not been christmas busy i've been struggling to even feel like christmas feel like it's christmas because my kids aren't here i don't have small children that are excited and bouncing it's around me. exactly and um we're missing a few people this year yes so and, and that in and of itself is making it hard. You're um, right. Do I make some the right size? No, they're kind of big, Marion. Okay, Marion's making bowling balls. I'm making bowling balls. Okay, smaller, smaller portions, smaller <laughs> portions. But um, you know, so there's some, there's things that just got to be different, and yes. um, we're working on making some different traditions and, and yes. um, accommodating everybody's schedules. <laughs> Marion and I were on the phone, yeah. and she's trying to figure out when she can have Christmas. With her and her boys. Yes. And it, it's it's just, you know, when people work, it is it is so hard. I mean we can squeeze it in, but it's some silly it's not two the same. it's not the same. And it's it's two, three hours. It's not like automatically Christmas Eve we're together. Not happening. Yeah. So Or you wake up Christmas morning. Morning. We are not together Christmas morning either. And you have the whole day. You have the whole, whole day, day together. Yeah. Yes, it's not. It's not like that. Yeah, um, one of Marion's sons works nights. Nights, so and so that makes it extra interesting. Yes, and they're you know they're trying to plan time um, with together. their dad. Yes, and Marion is trying to plan time yes. with Josh, Josh. And, and his. Yes, and my sister. Yes, and, and my, my sister's coming. My sister's is, coming. All good things. Mm. All good things. It just has to put under one umbrella and. Yeah. yeah, so I've also noticed that several of my friends, um, 
They don't worry about it being Christmas Day. Yes. They don't worry about it even being Christmas Eve. Um, they just, they, they pick a date, they have a date, and everybody plans for it so that it can accommodate everybody and they can make arrangements that they need to make. And I think that's what, what the direction um, I think I'm, I'm going to go to towards. Yes. Like we, uh, I, I visited Oklahoma last week. Yeah. And that family I visited, um, they had Christmas last week. Yeah. And it was wonderful. We did everything Christmassy. Here comes one of my people. Hi, Alex. Yeah, so Alex, you're in the season two with grown kids, right? I mean, glad you have your mom over there right now, but it is hard to... There's one of mine. There's one, yay, you got one. I got one home. You got one home. Two more to go. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, but you have each other. This was doing, this was doing was making cookies. Yes, Judy, that's what we are gonna start doing because we don't have little people anymore who wanna make cookies and eat the dough and you know, all the fun stuff. But I started this today by myself. Yes. Because I wanted, I wanted, this is just something that I enjoy doing at Christmas. And I, yes. and I usually make I lots of different cookies. Yes. And then I would give them, I would put them in um, containers and mm -hmm. you know, for like John's work and whatnot. And I haven't done that the last couple of years. See, and I, I make cookies, I make cookies early this year and I gave them away to all my customers. So they all, they all got cookies and then they got them eaten and I haven't had time to make more. Well, it makes me realize, you know, cause last night. <laughs> oh, they're both off on Christmas day. Yeah, see, yeah, good, yeah. good. But not on Christmas Eve, you're, right? So, yeah. Um, I was waiting on my um, Amazon, my last Amazon order last night and I'm following it and uh, it was supposed <laughs> to get here. 11 o'clock at night and still no Amazon order. And um, it's it's supposed to be here today. We'll see. She even, but she she put a treat out there. I put, there. I did. I put, I put a, a treat out um, there for an her. Excess energy drink, and I realized I didn't have any cookies. That was uh, partly what like motivated me today to, to make some to do yeah. it. But um, I put out some of Nana's um, this peanut butter fudge oh and gosh. her payday put, bar candy. Make, yes. I put one of those in a little baggie and put it on the front porch for my Amazon driver. Yes, that's wonderful. And I'm um, my FedEx guy will be here tomorrow. And so I'm gonna, um, he'll get cookies. He will get cookies. <laughs> Cause I'll have cookies made by them. Okay. Um, for them. But um, we want to, if you're going through the season where things are changing and you can't have the same um, celebrations, the same, at the same time. The same traditions. The date and the time don't matter okay. so much as the people that you're with. Exactly. And if you have to change things up mm -hmm. and do them at a different time, a different day, then you change them up and you mm -hmm. do them at a different time and a different day. day. Exactly. Because it's the people that you're with that matters. Exactly. And just being grateful, you know, and that you still have some. Like fair life. warning to all my bigs, all my big peoples. Next year it's good, we're just, I wanna do something different. I want, um, instead of all of us showing up, eating, opening presents and leaving and going to bed, <laughs> um, I think mm -hmm. we're gonna, we're gonna do, we're gonna, there's gonna be something that we do. Yes, yes. I don't know if it make cookies or, you know, make a big pot of soup together, mm -hmm. which doesn't sound like that much fun. Yeah. But, um, <laughs> um, build, have a gingerbread building contest Just or... A painting. Painting. Oh, that painting with a twist. Just something like that. We'll see. That yeah. maybe. We'll see. We're going to have, we will have a little person in the house next year. Yeah. So it will be all different anyways. A little, a little car as well. Awesome. Um, so th that will change things up even uh, yet again. But, but then even more so because, you know, their family needs to yeah. start their own traditions. traditions. Exactly, exactly, exactly. <coughs> and what I did actually, a lot of years, um, we can't do any more right now because of people growing up and, you know, um, we, used to, we used to go on trips on Christmas. Mm. We used to just take off and be somewhere else on Christmas. Yeah. Just instead of gifts, we, uh, we traveled. And uh, that is something fun to do too, instead of doing gifts. So. All right, I think we got a tray here, Marion. I, I think, think if we so keep too. making more, it's gonna fill up the, the tray yes. too much. Yes. But these are, um, what, what are those? I'm making, they're all keto friendly. Keto, so yay. I'm, I'm, <laughs> these have orange in them. They're, um, I can see that. They're ricotta, something ricotta. I don't, I don't see where the recipe is. Oh, uh, ricotta. But ricotta? They, have, they have orange, orange zest in them. Okay. I'm gonna just put this one in there. I love orange flavored anything. 
They're a keto Italian ricotta cookies. And they've got orange zest in them. And then you put like a, um, a glaze um, frosting type on them after they cool. So, um, like I said, I love everything orange. So I'm excited about these new recipes. The dough tasted good when I tasted the dough. It smells good. It, it has, does. It has that orangey, mm -hmm. orangey there's, flavor. There's the zest of two oranges Which in is, the. Oh wow! So they'll have a good orange flavor yeah. yes. on them. But um, anyway, we wanted to get, get mm -hmm. on here and just you know let you guys encourage mm -hmm. you, um, yes. let you know that we're kind of all in the same boat as we. As we get older, as we get older, and our kids are older mm -hmm. and growing and doing their own things, and what we have to be happy about that they have jobs that they, you know, and do stuff with their life. So we have to be happy and grateful about it. So we count our blessings, I guess, in the midst of giving up as a mom. Oh yeah, in the and midst it's not of that we're quitting giving. No, up. no, 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 it's no. That we're giving up our kids, kids, and giving up traditions and and certain things, and being okay with it. Yes, and being okay with it. That's the fun part. Yes. And so, Joy. You know, to have our mom hearts still... Still there. See, and, and this is what, I, what hit me today. Now I know how my mom feels. Mm -hmm. Or, you know... And you're a whole ocean away. Yeah, I'm a whole ocean away. You know, so when you get older, you just feel this a little bit more. So, yeah. 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 So that's hard. That's hard. Anyway. So, and anyways. Merry I guess, Christmas. Merry Christmas. A Happy New Year. Happy New Year, because we you guys won't see us again no, until no. New Year. No, and then for next year, I think we need to talk about the the word of the year again because it's already oh yes in in my mind. So start maybe thinking about it. Um, for what your word, what, what you want what your word to, to be, be for the for year for the year for next year. Twenty twenty three, guys. Exactly. Twenty twenty three. Twenty twenty three. Craziness. I know. We're good. It's it's crazy. But your word should inspire yeah. you. It should be something that you can. Um, Kind of set your goals around. Yes. And it, and in a, in a word that you can um, thrive and and make like decisions that can help yes. direct you. Yes. Like this year, the, my word was bold. 2022 was bold, being mm -hmm. bold in Christ. And <laughs> yes, I could have been better, but there's also we things. Always can be better. But there's also things I think I've been bold when you I have. look back. Mm -hmm. There is boldness there. Definitely. So. I was living it out. Oh, Alex, miss y'all. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Last year, New Year's, I, I was over there. Yeah, so, yeah. Yeah, time changes. Craziness, you know? Um, Hi, Ripley. Yes, yeah, so, so think about your word. Think yes. about what you want it to be. My word for last year was joy. Mm -hmm. and, and, I, and I did mm -hmm. find joy. And I did find things that I found joy mm -hmm. in. And I do feel like I was able to bring joy yes. to others. Yes. Um, so I'm not sure what this year's word's gonna be. I don't know. I'm kind of holding my breath to get through Christmas, Christmas, <laughs> and then New Year's, yes. um, and then and and finding the joy mm -hmm. in this in Christmas. This message. Yes. That's your last task. It is. It is. So we need to write about this afterwards. We do. We do. Yeah. So, um, so yes, Judy, the cookies are close together because they don't flatten out. They stay balls. They stay balls. Yes. They stay round. And I put them close together, so I'm not really a baker. Or yeah, I might take a few off. And, and a roof faller. So just might, get the stuff I might done. Take them, I might take them off a few off, okay. and, and we'll just do them in the next batch. In the next but, batch. Um, I'm excited about making cookies that are keto friendly, mm -hmm. and yes. I can eat them without the uh, massive sugar issues. Yes. Cause I think that might be part of my yeah. my challenge here lately is that yeah. um, I've been eating more sugar than I should. should. <laughs> I've had this stupid bug guys. Oh. Yes, not fun. No, 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 no. But um, if you have got a word already, we'd love yes, to hear it, share it. Yes, um, if you have enough, traditions, share them. What, what do you do with your family? Yes. Um, when your kids are, are bigs. Bigs, exactly. And if you do something fun when uh, the kids are a little. Like, I, liked, I liked, okay, so Marion, tell them what you guys did in Oklahoma. What about the um, the lights and the stuff? The lights, we, they rented a party bus. Mm -hmm. So, and they made cups. Cause there was how many people? Like a 30, lot, like 30. 30. 30 people, 20, 30 people, lots of people. And um, all, they, all together in the same place. Yes, and uh, <laughs> they rented a bus. 
and we got matching cups with our names on it. So we had cho chocolate to take. And um, they rented a bus and we looked at um, party drove, lights. Drove through the lights. Through, through the lights, like how we have it here, Blora. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, and drove through it. All together, All on the together bus. in the bus. Talking, looking at the lights, ooing, aahing. And having hot chocolate. Having hot chocolate and other drinks. And, uh, <laughs> and, and the kids were there, lots of kids, you know. So it was fun. It was good to experience. And this. then you went back to the house. And, and just relaxed. And hung out. Yes. So, you know, that sounds, that's, that sounds, that's, that sounds fun. Yes. Yes. Because we were, I was thinking, go look at lights, but we don't all fit in one vehicle, and you're the same yes. situation. Everybody yes. doesn't fit in one vehicle. vehicle. No. Yeah, when you have more people. And it's not the same when you're in like two or three vehicles. vehicles. No. Not even when you have walkie talkies. No, 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 no. So, okay. Anyway, guys. Anyways, it's um. We love you all. Thank you for being with us for the whole year. Yeah, another year. Another year down, and we're gonna go. What does 2023 have for mm -hmm. the mom box? The mom box. We don't know. And be the best you. It's just, you know, we're planning. We've we're got, planning. We've got a date set to plan out the next year, year or at least the next few months. And, you know, if you want to hear something special or whatever, you always let us know. Right. Yep. So. Okay. Anyway, we love you guys. Love you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Can we reach over here?